it's an intriguing premise. It's about a woman who buys a painting at a junk store as a joke present for her neighbor's birthday. She lives in a trailer park in Bakersfield, California. And it becomes clear after she's purchased this painting for $3 that it's possibly a Jackson Pollock. And the play takes place when an art expert comes to analyze the painting and determine whether it's real. He's kind of intrigued and uh, somewhat terrified by this uh, very interesting woman. And she's a, she's a force and she's a presence and she has very, very important points that she brings up in terms of value and what is value and the question of value and am I valuable and is she valuable? And so throughout the play, something that he believes to be true at the beginning, he starts questioning and uh, that's what makes him stay. It's also very, very funny because they're, they're so opposite. Like you get this very, you know, highbrow and this very grounded salt of the earth. She swears like a trooper. He's very closed off in certain ways. They're almost like uh, red and white clowns in a way. You know, the beginning of the show is really rife with a big, big language. But the, the challenge is for everybody to recognize at some point in the play, they're judging somebody too quickly based on bad language and suddenly they're throwing the baby out with the bathwater and you might have just said sayonara to somebody who could have had the power to change your entire perception of life.